Right, guys, now let's continue working problems on implicit functions. Let's see what happens here. I can see that x square and y square is here, and I can see that x and y are mixed up here, basically, right, with the product rule. So these kind of functions basically called implicit functions. What am I supposed to do? Differentiate them regularly with all the same regular. We are not learning anything new. The same rules and the formulas are applied, all right? So just take this guy as 2x. I would not write dx by dx. It cancels to give you 1. So here I can see two functions okay I take x and y as two different functions u and b let's say so I take two out I gotta differentiate x into y all right this is a more easier way for all you can write the constant outside the bracket and differentiate the next step it works easy so what about this guy how do you differentiate uh, 3y squared that is 3 into 2y into dy by dx I would write dy by dx every time I have any any function in terms of y, y all right so now Differentiation of x is 1 and differentiation of y is dy by dx minus 0 is equal to 0. That's what we have. All right. Now, what is the next thing? I still got to differentiate these guys, but I would use a product rule here. So it goes like 2x plus 2. It goes like x into dy by dx plus y into 1. Okay. Now, that is 6y into dy by dx plus 1 plus dy by dx. Now, what exactly I'm looking for is dy by dx. So keep this guy on the left hand side. All the terms containing dy by dx on the left hand side. That's it. So can I anyway open this guys? Yes. So I can write 2x plus 2x in a dy by dx plus 2y plus 6y in a dy by dx plus 1 plus dy by dx. So this is what we have. So I'll keep this guy, this guy, this guy on the left hand side and put all the others on the other side. So that goes like 2x, okay. I'll write 2x in a dy by dx plus I'll write 6y in a dy by dx, okay. And I'll write dy by dx. So this, these are three guys which have dy by dx on the left hand side. The other three guys, that is 2x, 2y and 1, I would put on the other side that goes like minus 2x, minus 2y, minus 1. That's what I have, right? Now what's the next thing? Take dy by dx com. So I'm looking for this guy itself, right? dy by dx is what I'm looking for. That is 2x plus 6y plus 1 is minus 2x minus 2y minus 1. So what happens now? Put the whole thing down there. So what do you get? So you get dy by dx, what you're looking for. That is minus 2x minus 2y minus 1, the whole thing divided by 2x plus 6y plus 1. Okay, that's your simple answer. All right, so let's do a couple of more problems based on implicit functions and see what happens.